In today's video, we are busting a road trip mission from Los Angeles to Las Vegas to check out the brand new $2.3 billion sphere, which is 366 feet tall and 516 feet wide. But you guys will see within this video, it was a mission and a half to get there. But first stop, we stopped at Pops to get a Philly cheesesteak. If y'all come to Vegas, go to Pops. It's a bit off the strip, but it is worth the drive. What's up, y'all? We are back here in Las Vegas to check out the brand new 2.3 billion, I was gonna say million, billion dollar sphere. This sphere is kind of crazy, y'all. It's gonna cost the city a lot of money, tell you that. You know what, and also, too, I just wanna say, even though we literally just got into the city right now, this is already causing a lot of traffic. Like, I feel like this is gonna be really dramatic for the city. Well and the sun's out, and they have it running too right now. Yes, I'm so, like, it's gonna be expensive that way, it's gonna be expensive for traffic, it's gonna be expensive for accidents, because everybody's just like, oh my gosh, look at this. We have not seen it at night, as you guys can tell, there is still sunlight. Um, but first, before we jump into going to the sphere, we wanted to show you guys our room at Planet Hollywood. To give you guys a little bit of a room tour, we are staying at a standard, regular room um, at the Planet Hollywood North Tower. It's and considered a strip view. It's, y'all, it's yeah. not a strip no. view. It's really, honestly, and on top of that, too, these windows are like really dirty but I, I mean we got a view of the awful tower yeah, we got the Apple Tower, which it does light up at nighttime, so hopefully I'll get a clip later. Get Bob, a little show. I'll probably be a little bit too tipsy then. Um, anyways, we just want to start this off with a little bit of room tour, and then we're going to be walking over to our parents' room. They're staying across the street at the Cosmopolitan, and they get a nice room over there. We are not in a suite this time. If you guys checked out our previous Vegas videos, we stayed in multiple suites. This time, we couldn't get the hookup on those suites because it is summer months, so we don't get that we much of a room, deal. room, though. That's all that matters. Exactly. A free room with no resort fees. We exactly. did get this for free because my mom does gamble a lot, so she hooked us up. Um, anyways, make sure you guys give us a big thumbs up. We're going to give you guys a little bit of room tour. Walk over there, and then we're going to go to the Sphere. Don't know what else we're going to do in this video, but stay tuned for our previous Las Vegas video because we're going to be eating fast food restaurants by celebrities for 24 hours. And we are going to switch it up and not go to Bobby Flay's, even though I really do want to go to Bobby Flay's. Like, really bad. Nah, I am. Burger's better. Burger is not a fast food restaurant. This fool wants to go to Burger, which is Gordon Ramsay's restaurant here in Planet Hollywood. I love that place. It's my favorite Vegas. Y'all, it is delicious, but it bothers me that before COVID, my burger was $19. After COVID, it is $29, a $10 it upgraded like charge. It's a personal problem. It's, uh, I'm sorry, but $10 <laughs> like that, I could understand a couple dollars. I totally get it, but like 10, I'm like, no. Anyways, let me not ramble. Let me shut up. Let's go ahead and get into this room tour. Nate's going to be leading it. I'm going to be filming it. Let's get into it. So once again, this is a standard strip view room in the north tower when you come in you automatically see the restroom on your left hand side which is actually pretty big for a standard room and then when you come on in both on the left and well my left and then the right hand side we're going to have a as Timmy was saying his and her sinks I guess but that's more when you're side by side but so you have two different sinks we got a stand-up shower which is pretty nice then we got a nice tub Little downside doesn't have jets in it. I prefer double jets. And then we got a little private section for if someone has the beer shits, if you will, so you won't be able to smell that over there. Nasty. Oh yeah. my gosh. Well, when people go to Vegas, they, you know, what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas, man. But then you come in here, it's actually, I mean, I'm really surprised, honestly, for just our regular room. It is pretty damn big. It and is pretty all of big. These are supposed to be queen size beds. Two queen beds. Um, to me, they don't really look like queen size, honestly. Um, also, too, come over here. You got a nice little bench see girls want to do your makeup come over here i do want to say speaking of girls doing their makeup right here and boys there is no mirror like why is there no big mirror right here i really feel like there should be a big mirror they really missed the opportunity on that yeah, because that would be lamp. what is a lamp gonna do you need a mirror to see yourself but you got some three drawers right there also too which is nice about this room is we have a little mini fridge it's not a, a mini bar. fridge it's surprising right yes not a mini bar most of them are mini bars yeah and then uh well, you got, you got the, the TV, TV, you got you your view, and then there you go. That's the little table right there. And Nate does want to note that these chairs are very, very comfortable. Healthy. And while I'm right here, I can admire Dua Lipa on the wall. That is not Dua Lipa. You're telling me the one on the right is not Dua Lipa. 
I don't know, maybe it is. Yeah, comment down below. See what you guys think, alright? Now we're gonna be heading over to our parents' room at the Cosmopolitan. First, I'm gonna grab me a drink for the road. Let me give you guys a little bit of a tip. In Vegas, you guys can take your alcohol anywhere, so stock up in the room, get them cold, take them out onto the strip, because honestly, if you're gonna be purchasing at a bar, they are pricey. Obviously, you can gamble and like leave a tip and get a drink then, but you are allowed to take your drinks literally everywhere. Walk them out in the public, walk them in the bathroom, walk them wherever you want, so make sure you guys take your drinks for the road. Let's go ahead and head on over to the Cosmopolitan. We're here now at the beautiful Cosmopolitan. As you guys know, we can't afford to stay here, so we come here. It's luxurious. It's and luxurious, so beautiful. It, honestly, I love the rooms here. I love the location. This is actually That's probably one of the best hotels on the strip, if I'm being quite honest. But I can't afford to stay here, so we film our parents' room because we're poor and, and we're staying across the way. It. Yeah. Well, actually, I mean. Well, it, afford it, get it for free. It's all the same. Exactly. Right? If you gamble a lot, you get hooked up. Anyways, we're going to give you guys a little bit of a room tour right here. This is a sweet view, or not sweet view. This is a. I would say, honestly, I just call it a Bellagio fountain view. Bellagio found you. That's, That's a good way to put it. it. I told you guys know I had three happy dads and I'm literally already tipsy because I realized I have not eaten since 1130 and it's seven o'clock. So it's gonna be a fun rest of the night. This is gonna be a mess of a video, but we will make it to the sphere. That's the whole point of this video is to go to the sphere. We will get there. I just probably will be super tipsy by then. Just we'll letting you guys know. We'll see if I'm dragging him later. Maybe I yeah. will. It'll be he, fun. He was making fun not. of me because last time I was like so tipsy. I was at the Aria and there was this girl rolling around on a like big old carpet vacuumer. And I was like, oh. I love your car. And she got so excited. She was like, thank you. She's and a I, little princess wave, yeah. I literally was thinking that she was like um, the X-Men guy. I forget his name. Professor Xavier. Professor. I literally thought that was her in my mind, but I was so tipsy. You know what I'm saying? Anyways, let me shut up. Let's get into this room review because you guys want to see this because it is beautiful. All right, y'all. So this is the entryway right here. And Nate is leading the show once again because he does not know how to film. And every single time I tell him to film me, my boobs are just in it. Well, so are mine. But well, yours are in it regardless, but I still got you in frame. I though. try working out. It doesn't work. Anyways. Hey, man. So, bring on the food. Anyways, right. go ahead with your tour. Damn right. We're in Vegas, right? Selling Sunset. Come on. <laughs> I don't even know what that is. Oh, you, it's a reality show. Uh, I don't watch reality show. So we come in here. First off, you can notice the difference. So it's, it's a lot more narrow, right? But you come in. You come into the restroom. We got a his and her sink. Separate. I like it. this in Vegas. I've noticed this. They have like a separate restroom or a toilet, if you will from uh, the shower and the tub. But so that way people can be in the shower and somebody can still use the restroom, you know. And I guess uh, eliminates the smell a little more, maybe. Yeah, true. But you got a stand-up shower, which is, I was expecting like a rain shower hit in this one. No, it's just a regular one. But they have a bigger shower, which is cool. It's and they still have beautiful. A, they still have it, and then they also have a tub. I think this one has the little jets. I saw a bunch of little holes at the bottom. But honestly, I kind of prefer ours. Ours is- This room is much smaller. It, it is, but it has a way better view. And here we are now into the main area. I do want to say the lighting in this room is extremely dark. It's meant throughout to be- Throughout the hotel. Yes, throughout it's the whole entire hotel. It's meant to be a little bit more seductive, I would say. I don't, if I'm having my escorts up here, I don't want to, I'm already Oh, don't, about, Nate, we don't need you to stop. He's oh. only escorting some food up here. That's all oh, he's doing. my bad, anyways. <laughs> um, this is the living room right here, and you are greeted with somebody's backside and a little bit of crack. See, though, it, it goes with the whole escort thing. I think, I think because, you know, rich people stay here, they try to lead people on, if you know what I mean. No, and also in Vegas, if you guys come to Cosmopolitan, the most pro pros come here. And by pro, you know what I'm saying? I can't say it on YouTube, but put it together. The pro pros come here. Also something to note, they have two TVs, which is yes. kind of weird, because for their little living room section, two TVs, bigger. one here, and then down at the end, and then one But over it's weird there. that this bedroom TV is smaller, because I think a lot more people are going to spend more time over here. But then you come yes. over here and then, what would you say? This, this is a, a king? A king. Oh, that like is a king. a king size bed. Yeah. That's then, it. And then, oh, let's go ahead and show. Oh, yeah, yeah. This I is mean, the closet. We got some closets right here. Who cares about that? There's a closet. Cool. Yeah. Light turns on. Bam. Show yes. them the balcony, Nate. That's what they really want to see. Ugh. Now, they come out here. You got great views. Great you have, views. You have one singular chair, and you actually have a little uh, little couch for outside. Yes. So if you want to come out during the night and watch the little fountain show, have a little fun for your freaky people. Um, cool. It's a great thing. Okay. Beautiful. This is for the rich people. Us poor people cannot afford this. If you're rich, go to the top. This way you can look at the sphere at least. Yes, go to the sphere. 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 We'll make sphere. our way there eventually. It I'm going like to get some pickles. Too. It looks like my head. Mm -hmm. Your head's not that round. I'm sorry. Shade. Three hours later. We are finally making our way to the sphere. Well, we're gonna stop for drinks first. Slowly. And actually, I'm not that drunk. He, he sobered up a lot, honestly. A lot. Of a lot. 
literally, it took 45 minutes for a drink. I'm ready to drink. Y'all, it is literally midnight. And we have walked already 0.9 miles. And we have another mile to go, but we're gonna make it. Partner is dying back here. I told you, I'm we're dying. We're gonna go no matter what. Whether we're making about it. Dragging him or not? It's the point of the video. I will be tipsy though after because I'm making him. I'm making him. I'm making him hold my drinks right now because I was like, pack we're right gonna right film now, the pack. If you were the pack meal, you'd be carrying me. But y'all, it has been rough. We're making it down the strip to the sphere. It is popping. Honestly, and I need some we drink. didn't think it was going to be this far. Yes, it's so far. If you guys are walking from Planet Hollywood, don't do it. Take a Uber, but we're getting there. When I tell you guys I'm ready to fight, we literally have walked for 40 minutes. 40 minutes to get to the sphere. And I will turn the camera around. Don't pay attention to Nate behind me. He is holding both my drinks because I am double fisting. I needed to double fist over here. This mother effing spear, ooh, I said spear, spear, is literally, it's so loud right here right now, the spear is turned off. It was on all day. We will come back to show you guys for this video. Literally, hopefully it's on tomorrow, but it's literally off right now. It's off, turned off. I will turn the camera around in just a second, but it's off, off. And it's like, you know, 12.30, but it should be on. Like, it's on all during the day, but not right now. I am pissed. The audio is gonna be horrible right now because it is obviously loud as hell over here. But that right there is the sphere. As you guys can tell, it is not on. I am pissed we walked this far and it's not on. But we will come back tomorrow night, hopefully earlier, so that we will show you guys when it's on. But just letting you guys know, it is not on and I hate, I hate you. I hate you. We How walked so on? far. How was it on during the day, but not at night? It was on literally during daytime, but not right now. And it's literally only 1230. Like, come on. Y'all, I literally hope you guys give this video a big thumbs up because we walked this far. I told Nate I have to sit down now and drink some of my Mountain Dew. I'm out of breath. My boobs are sweating. Everything's sweating on me, to be quite honest with you guys. I'm taking a little break right here by Harris. I can't believe this was turned off. It's literally turned off. It's okay though, tomorrow we're coming back. We're coming back, well it's earlier. We understand it's past midnight, but we will be making it back. In the meantime though, Mountain Dew, hard seltzers, bomb.com. We're back at the hotel. I am dripping in sweat. We busted our ass only because we didn't want to spend $35 for an Uber. But we are back, poor Nate, look at him. He's dead. I am Only I am you can prevent OB. my brother from dying for 35 cents a day. Please send it over to I'll Sarah McLaughlin. Oh no, you're past that point, homie. Oh, Anyways, you. tomorrow we are gonna try again to go back to the sphere. You guys will see at the end of this video if we make it back or not. You guys will not. see it no matter what. It is my personal mission. We're getting there. Even if it's daytime, we're getting there. Don't worry. We will be back when the sphere is on and popping. The next day. Okay, lighting is horrible, but we have made it to the sphere. We've made it. It's right behind us. Day two. Bam. We made it. Day two. You can't see us, but it's okay. Woo! You can't see us, but you can see the sphere. Bam. We made it. We're here. It's a giant blue basketball, like blue balls. Little yes, little. big old blue ball right behind yeah. us. I'm all switches to something oh, look, better, but we made it! Now. If y'all have made it this far in the video, don't forget to give a big thumbs up. We would appreciate it, especially because we busted our asses to get to that sphere. It was a mission and a half. We'll catch you guys in the next video.